see your clappers and hammers and things. Uh, we have a complete new clappers, they're all on order at the moment. But the bells get worn as they're rung over a period of time, which is why your bells are going to turn a little bit to, yeah. uh, so the clapper strikes on a new bit. To do it quite a long time on the bus. special about two magnus bells two magnus bells are quite important um, particularly the, the the two that have come out because the last um, bell that was cast in the chew valley we believe was cast in the chew valley is one of the two bells that we're we're loading in today and were they particularly difficult to work with because of that not particularly no when they were hung before, um, they had massive arch headstocks on and they never really behaved, those two bells, uh, like the rest of them. So the idea is to try and iron out the lumps and bumps and make it an instrument which is a, a lot easier to, to, to use as a whole. The headstocks on these two particular bells have been replaced. Um, it's the swinging gear effectively. The original headstocks were like big humpback bridges and they counterbalance the speed of the bells. So these two bells, um, which have got their cannons on, um, which are the original supporting loops that were cast in place as part of the manufacture, because they're important bells, they've been preserved. Um, and therefore... Um, so they don't form any part of the mechanism They then? don't form part no. of any mechanism no. now. No. They're just uh, there as a, kept as a relic. And they should fit in neater with the other bells in the peel. They were always a bit of a hiatus in the middle of the ring of bells. So that's what we've replaced. Um, so are you saying that our bell ringers have no excuses for not being perfect now? They, they, they should be absolutely amazing. <laughs> will sound a little brighter and a little more resonant because they've got newly designed clappers which is the, obviously the, the tongue inside the bell which makes the noise and the old ones are quite heavy uh, and, and pretty worn so the new ones are state-of-the-art technology so the bells should ring a little brighter than they did before the sound remains the same there hasn't been any tuning work done on the bells um, so hopefully um, they will uh, they will ring uh, out for very many years to come uh, and uh, give the, uh, the parish uh, another hundred years of service. Excited actually, yes, it's a really good occasion. You know, feel all that time, all that work, and the fundraising, and just to hear them ringing again. Yeah. 